Bigfoot chainsaw carving. This is a chainsaw carving I done of Bigfoot. Now that we're done sawing, we'll take a look at some of the work here. Here's the hair that we put on the back of the uh, Bigfoot. Here's the face. We're getting ready to put the arms on next. We used a dime tip skill chainsaw to do the detail work. Here we're getting ready to put an arm on the Bigfoot. These big Bigfoot arms probably weigh 50 pounds apiece. We're pre-drilling the arms and using lag bolts to connect them to the sculpture. We'll put these bolts in far enough where we can put wood filler over the head of the bolt to cover them up. We won't be able to tell they're there. Then we'll paint over them. There we got the second arm on. We're doing a couple small adjustments. Here we're using star tip lag bolts. We put quite a few of these in on each side to hold the arms on. We're using star tip lag bolts. I think these are about nine or 10 inch screws. These 
these arms will never move after you get these lag bolts in. Here we're using wood filler. It's a sustainable wood filler you can get it at Lowe's. We're filling in the heads of the bolts. That way we can paint over them. This wood filler will be dry in about a day or two. Again, this is sustainable wood filler. You can get it at Lowe's. filler dries, we'll sand over to a little bit and make it smooth, and then we'll paint over it. And then we'll put our sealer over the paint. There's Bigfoot. He looks pretty good all put together. The next step will be burning him with a uh, propane torch. That brings out the grain of the wood. And it also makes him much darker. There's the glass eyes we got off the internet for about $15. Those are doll eyes. Here we're burning a big foot of the torch. This makes it much darker and burns out the grain of the wood. Now we're brushing Bigfoot off with a steel brush, getting all the charcoal off of him. And then we'll blow him off with a blower mask. Bigfoot's ready to be painted with Memwax, Helmsman Outdoor <laughs> Protective Coating. This outdoor protective clear coat will put several coats of it on him and then he'll be waterproof. 
Plus it gives him a nice shine. He won't crack in the sunlight either with this coating on him. Again, that's Helmsman Memwax. You can get that at Lowe's. So Bigfoot's ready to be sold now. Here we have Bigfoot. He's guarding the front door, making sure that everybody that comes here wears a mask. And he also scares off bill collectors, hopefully. I thought this would be a dry place to put him under the front uh, porch so he wouldn't get wet. He's too big to tote around too many places. He probably weighs 400 pounds. So I thought this would be a good place for him to stand at, at the front door. Thanks for watching. That's the end.